triangular prism. So how do we find the total surface area of a triangular prism? First of all, you're going to go ahead, find the lateral surface area. That will be perimeter times height. Then you will add the area of the two triangles. The area of one triangle is one half times base times height. And there are two of them, this side here and the other side here is a triangle. Therefore, we're going to have to multiply it by 2. So this is the whole formula of your total surface area for a triangular prism. Now let's go ahead and do substitution. We said in class that the perimeter of one of the triangles is going to be the letter P here. So we have to add the three side lengths of one triangle. Then multiply by the height. The height that we're going to use here is the length of the one of the rectangles, okay? They're all the same, 10 cm. The length of the rectangles, because this is your lateral. All the rectangles, the sides that are rectangles, are the lateral surface of this triangular prism. So the height will be this 10 cm, okay? Not the height of the triangle. This height is the length of the rectangle on the side. Okay, now let's go ahead and add the two areas of the bases, which are the two triangles. So for one triangle, the area will be one half times base times height, then times two because there's two of them. The base here is this 12, and the height of that triangle is the 16. This is what you're going to enter on your calculator. Total surface area of the triangle triangular prism is 672 square centimeters.